Nigeria is to spend some $312 million in the coming days on infrastructure development. The announcement made by the country's Vice President, Yemi Osin Banjo, comes at a time the West African country is struggling to revive its economy, which is on the brink of recession. Nigeria's current economic woes have been triggered by the decline in oil prices on the global market as oil revenue accounts for about 70% of the country's income. The main sectors for which the funds have been released are power, works and housing, defense, transportation and agriculture. One of the first areas in which we have brought change is in public financial management. This has had a consequential effect of saving jobs as well as jobs. The Nigerian government's capital spending has shot up to 332 billion naira, but Yemi Osibanjo assures the government will keep its spending in check to a minimum of 30 percent. He, however, says an additional 100 billion naira will be released in the coming days. Many of Nigeria's 36 federal states are said to be struggling to pay salaries of civil servants in spite of assistance from the federal government. With oil prices still on the decline, the government is struggling to fund its record $30 billion budget.